So there comes a time when you're using Aperture where something will go wrong, maybe the program will crash or your machine will crash or lock up, or just generally you have a bad day and something happens to the library and it gets corrupted and it won't load properly. Well, it's not all is lost. There is the don't panic button as I tend to think of it. And what you can do is if you hold down the command and the option key and you click on the icon to start Aperture, it's gonna bring up this little panel. And this is the first aid panel and it gives you three options and essentially you can start at the top of the list and work your way down you can choose the repair permissions and that's gonna try and check the files and the permissions on those files in the library and try to repair them uh, you do have to have administrator access or know the administrator password to, to perform this then the next option down if that doesn't work you can try and repair the database it's gonna check it for inconsistencies and try to fix those for you and as a last result you can actually go in and choose this one which is the rebuild database and that's going to take all the files and information that it can find and reconstruct a, a new database for you around that data and hopefully that will fix your problems so what you can do is we're just going to choose the uh, repair database here and then you can just choose repair and it's going to go away and depending on the size of your library it'll take a while and we'll see what happens. Now when it's finished performing the operations for you, it's gonna load Aperture and try and work with that database that it's tried to fix for you. And hopefully if everything works out correctly, you know, you'll be back and up and running and your database will be just fine and you can continue. But if not, you know, like I say, there are three different options you can try and see if you can get your library working again, but don't worry and don't panic. Not everything is lost. Apple does supply this first aid panel Again, it's the command and the option keys when you boot the program and that'll help try and repair some faults. You know, maybe you have an external hard drive that goes down, those kind of things. It does happen. And so just be aware that there is a tool to try and help fix these things for you.